It is not just skin cancer when it's the largest organ of the body. Functions of the skin include regulating body temperature, sensing painful and pleasurable stimuli, providing a protective barrier, and maintaining a balance of water and electrolytes. The skin has three layers. The epidermis is the thin outer layer of the skin, the dermis is the middle layer of the skin and the hypodermis is the deepest layer of skin. Melanocyte produces the protective skin darkening pigment melanin. Dendrites are used to transfer pigment granules to adjacent epidermal cells. Melanin is formed in organelles called melanosomes, then transferred through dendritic cell processes to adjacent keratinocytes. In the keratinocyte, melanin granules are mainly in the apical cytoplasm, where they may shield the nucleus from ultraviolet light. Ultraviolet rays are clearly a major cause of melanoma. UV rays can damage the DNA in skin cells. Thymine dimer is formed as a covalently bonded complex of two adjacent thymines on a single strand of DNA. UVA radiation damages the DNA in human melanocyte cells, causing mutations that can lead to melanoma. Eight typical dysplastic nevus or melanoma in situ and invasive melanoma are intermediates of transition. So the early detection of melanoma is important. Melanoma is usually diagnosed by a dermatologist, who examine for unusual changes, and assess all spots on the skin. Skin biopsies are commonly ordered for warts and moles, skin cancers and other growth, allergic reactions, bacterial or fungi infections, and acne. Biopsy procedures include anesthetizing the area and using a scalpel to thinly slice the skin lesion's top layer. Doctors usually perform punch biopsies for deeper skin lesions. Depending on the size of the sample, the area may or may not be closed with stitches. An excisional biopsy is a medical test in which the whole lesion or mass is removed and tested. A biopsy is an examination of tissue removed from a living body to discover the presence, cause, or extent of a disease. Melanoma is a rapidly growing malignant skin cancer. If melanoma is not diagnosed and treated, it will continue to grow. The Clark level is a staging system that describes the depth of melanoma as it grows in the skin. Melanoma can spread to other parts of body by going into the lymphatic system and blood vessels. The first place a melanoma tumor metastasizes to is the lymph nodes, by draining melanoma cells into the lymphatic fluid. Rural areas are those areas that do not have modern facilities, and their population is way lower than in cities. In rural communities agriculture is stated to be major occupation of the individual. Major livid activities of them are cultivation of food and cash crops, fish farming, cattle rearing dairying. So the people have to work under the sun for long hours. Many scientific studies indicate that prolonged sun exposure is the main cause of skin cancer. In rural areas of India, the medical facilities are not as developed as that of the urban areas. Our proposed solution focuses on those people who are devoid of these provisions. Now let's see the block diagram. The first stage is the image acquisition. Then comes image pre-processing. The next one is the segmentation stage. Then comes color corellogram. Next stage is feature extraction and classification. It classifies the given data set into cancerous or non-cancerous and the samples detected are shared with the dermatologist. There are different types of skin patches including birthmarks, pigmentation, disorders, rashes, infections, skin cancers. So in order to detect whether it is cancerous or non-cancerous, the diagnosing methodology uses image processing techniques which can be performed on MATLAB software. PH2 Dermoscopic Image Database is used for testing purposes. We are capturing the image using high-resolution camera, and given the test image as the input. Then it is subjected to various pre-processing for noise removal and image enhancement. Then the image undergo image segmentation. Feature extraction is the process of extracting the unique features from segmented image. Here shows the real part and magnitude part of feature extraction, and classified using the Bohr filter and SVM classifier respectively and shows the result is actinic keratosis. Now let's see the final product. A graphical interface is used. The image of skin is taken as input to the MATLAB. After completing pre-processing segmentation feature extraction and classification using SVM classifier, the value of input image is compared with the feature matrix of trained image, and if the input image matches with the value of cancerous image in the trained set, then the input image is classified as melanoma and vice versa. After classification if the skin lesion is found as cancerous, then details of the corresponding person is sent to the nearest dermatologist via email. Our project mainly focuses on the people of rural areas. In rural areas of India, the medical facilities are not as developed as that of the urban areas. 
so the details of patient is sent to the dermatologist via mail by simple mail transfer protocol. SMTP is a set of communication guidelines that allow software to transmit an electronic mail over the internet. This is the project output analysis. Thanks for watching the video.